National Legal Service Authority NALSA recruitment for various vacancies. It's a pay level for salaries around 25,500. It's a basic pay. It's a job vacancy 2022. It's a job for freshers as well. Before we get into this notification, I request you all to have a look into the latest job update playlist so that you will be having an edge of what are the recent notifications out there. The link for the latest job update playlist will be given in the eye icon or at the end screen of the video. Please do check it. This is the official notification of NLSA, National Legal Service Authority. This is an employment noti uh, notice. So the, the tentative schedule of events like uh, application form last date are this way. Uh, the commencement of online application has already started from 1-4-2022 from 2 p.m. The last date to apply online is 34-2022 and the last date uh, for the receipt of application fee is 34-2022. So you can visit the official website nalsa.gov.in uh, which is uh, National Legal Service Authority which are inviting applications for different vacancies like Junior Secretary Assistant, Stenographer Grade uh, grade D and the assistant librarian. So in this notification we will be seeing what are the different notifications and eligibility criteria as well. The notification for the different vacancies are stenographer, assistant librarian, junior secretariat assistant. So stenographer it is a level level 4 pay scale and uh, one vacancy for unreserved and the uh, total number of vacancies are just one vacancy and for assistant librarian level 4 pay scale only one vacancy that to for unreserved. A junior secretariat, uh, it is a level 2 pay scale, uh, one vacancy for unreserved, one vacancy for SC category, one vacancy for OBC, total of three vacancies. So this is, these are the required uh, number of vacancies for different vac uh, different posts like stenographer, assistant, librarian, junior secretariat. So the number of vacancies may increase or decrease without any notice depending upon the availability and the number of uh, vacancies as of date of preparation of the merit list and posting. So the candidate in order to apply for this one, you need to have attained at least 18 years. So at least 18 years and below 27 years of age as of the cutoff date for age is 34, 2022. So this is regarding the number of uh, the age criteria, minimum 18 years and maximum 27 years. And also relaxation is applicable for uh, different categories like OBC, SC, ST, PWD, ex-servicemen candidate. 5 years age relaxation for the upper age limit. Uh, for those who are working in government or semi-government or PSU corporations or board or board so highest relaxation for all the government employees so the qualification required is uh, for stenographer the qualification required is just a uh, 12th pass 12th standard or equivalent from ex any recognized board or university and uh, the candidate who are shortlisted in the written examination for the written ex uh, for the next stage will have to appear for the skill test in stenography and the candidate will have to give a one diction for 10 minutes of English at 80 words per minute. So in order to, if you just qualify, uh, the criteria is that you need to have, uh, go for a typing test of uh, 80 words per minute. See this is a stenographer, they will dictate uh, for 10 minutes and in that you need to uh, type for 80 words per minute. So it is a rigorous practice needed for this one, 80 words per minute is not that ordinary. For the post of stenographer D and uh, the matter will be uh, to be transcribed on the computer so there there will be a uh, one guy who will be who will be dictating the for 10 minutes and uh, for one minute at least 80 words per minute you need to type so this is what the stenographer job is all about so the qualification is just 12th standard uh, 12th pass is enough or equivalent so any graduate also apply because uh, that is beyond the 12th class for assistant librarian, the qualification is a degree in discipline with diploma uh, in library science or degree in library science from the recognized university. So knowledge on computer operations in library work, it includes like knowledge and experience of uh, working with any standard library or uh, automation software for housekeeping activities in library such as cataloging, acquisition and circulation etc. So knowledge and experience of computerized search are both on online and offline. So this is a must and also desirable is that you need to have experience in library or any government organization as educational or research institute and knowledge of computer typing in English. So it is not necessary that you need to have an experience but desirable. So you need to have a degree and discipline in library side that is a qualification required for assistant librarian and for junior secretary. The qualification is 
candidate must have passed the 12th standard or equivalent examination from the recognized board or university and the candidate who are shortlisted in written examination uh, this is the criteria the candidate who are shortlisted for written examination they need to appear for typing test that is 35 words per minute uh, this is uh, 35 words per minute uh, speed in English so for junior secretary assistant there will be written test and after the written test there will be a typing test of 35 words per minute this is the recruitment process for junior secretary assistant and the qualification required is just 12 pass and the mode of selection uh, for different uh, vacancies are uh, for the post of stenographer and junior secretary assistant the mode of selection will be written test a written test followed by skill test in that written test a general english so this is the syllabus for written test general english general aptitude general knowledge and computer a computer knowledge is the written test syllabus and also skill test uh, for the shortlisted candidates only so for the post of stenographer and the junior secretary assistant uh, written test exam written test will be comprising of four sections english aptitude no general knowledge gk that is and computer knowledge and also followed by skill test if you just qualify written test uh, depending upon the merit and number of candidates are applied they will go for skill test and this is the recruitment process for the stenographer and junior secretary assistant and for the post of assistant librarian the written test uh, that will be for assistant librarian it will be only written test written test that will be in the four sections general english general aptitude general knowledge computer knowledge and also post related so it will be five sections for assistant librarian the more one more section is uh, the library science related questions will be asked in the written examination so in order to register for this you need to visit the nalsa.gov.in and applicants must check their information before logging and submitting the application and uh, the admit cards, uh, e-admit cards uh, for the provisional eligible candidate will be uploaded on the website and they will be intimated via email so please do check it so the application fee in order to apply for this one is for general it is 500 rupees and uh, female candidates uh, no fees for female candidates and for SCST candidates no fees so for general and OBC candidates 500 rupees uh, plus bag charges so this is uh, regarding the examination fee criteria and uh, requisite fee must be paid online on or before the last date and uh, the time fixed for the purpose so no other payment is admissible so it is only online payment and the written test and skill test examination likely to be conducted the tentative schedule of uh, events that is uh, written test as well as uh, skill test is also given in the month of uh, May to June uh, the exact date will be informed in the official site at nalsa.gov.in so this is regarding the date of examination the written test as well as skill test will be conducted in the month of may to june so be prepared and type uh, practice well and practice typing also and applicants who fulfill the criteria the last day to apply is uh, uh, 34 2022 this is the last day to apply 34 2022 and uh, if you fulfill the criteria you just uh, click on and apply the link the link will be given in the description so this is regarding the NALSA National Legal Service Authority recruitment for various vacancies. The salary is around 25,500 is a pay level 4. If you are first to my channel, I request you all to please look into the latest job update playlist so that you will be having an edge of what are the recent notifications out there. Thank you for your time. Have a great day.